one. Yeah, if we don't build a new one, they'll come in and close this one at some point in time. It may be tomorrow, they said, too, you know, you never know. A little history on the jail. Back in 1966, they, uh, they uh, put it to the vote. They had a plan and everything, and I guess, my understanding, I wasn't very old in 66, so, uh, my understanding is it did get to 50, but it needed a 60%, you know, to, to go through, so that failed. And then in 2000, well, the commissioners, I've talked to old commissioners, and they've talked about it in early 80s, 90s, you know, about we have to do something with the jail. And then in 2002, they did a study, private study, and they said you had five, or five years, 10 years max to do something with the jail. And so in 2006, there was eight counties that got together out here, and we were looking at doing something, and then that was the year I lost election. So I don't know exactly what happened, but I heard the funding fell through or something like that, so that got dropped. So since I got reelected, I've talked to the commissioners about, you know, we have to do something with the jail. But the state has always said we met compliance, and then last year they come in and said, nope, so we have to do something, and that's where we sit. Well, right now we have to have a plan and a timeline for new jail. And I, I think we're getting close on a location. What's uh, the timeline? Well, we don't have one. That's part of the problem. 